We're rolling out. Welcome to my world. It is a rainy Saturday and it's been a great one. We woke up early. I actually, let's back up. I slept through the whole night, which is amazing. Woke up bright and early. We've been doing nothing today. Ruby went with my parents to a picnic. And Mark and I have seriously just been like doing nothing. I hear him in the other room playing video games. I'm laying on the bed, of course, working because that's what I love to do. Um... I actually have some exciting things coming to Liz Out Loud. Um, So you have to stay tuned for that. We're wrapping up our first year. And it's gone so fast. It's gone so fast. Um, But it's rare that we don't do anything. Like nothing. Nothing. I might actually go test drive a new vehicle. I'm like... Do I buy a pimped out luxury vehicle? Because I really, really love the Range Rover Evoque. Or do I get a sexy Jeep Wrangler pimped out, lifted, big old beefy tires on it? Like, that's that's my dilemma today. (laughs) But before I do that, I'm going to just take a little cat nap. I might get up and go through some clothes and get rid of what doesn't fit me or what's worn out or what doesn't bring me joy anymore. See if I can't fill up a couple totes of things to donate and just shift some stuff out of my house and out of my life. So yeah, it's, this is rare. Just laying around, not doing anything. It's kind of nice not really having to leave the house or do too much. I mean, we left the house to go car shopping and I'm just checking email, kind of game planning. I have my planner out. You guys all know that I'm a planner freak and I'm getting this week uh, set up and organized and things ready to go. And it's actually really nice for a summer weekend to slow down, not have to leave the house, not have anything I have to do, um, but get a game plan for the weeks, the week coming. It's like, I have all these like little bitty things that need to be done and errands and run here, do this, do that, do this. And it's like, ah, I hate, I hate running errands and like doing things. But I also know my laundry list of things is super long. And if I can just get all these little bitty things scratched off, it makes a huge difference. So that's what I'm focusing on this week. Um, Ruby School, her teacher sends a newsletter every week. Like, this is what we're working on. This is the Bible verse. Here's our sight words. And that's really nice to hear some important dates for the month. And so I've gotten that all scheduled in. Coffee dates, these things. All these little things that I uh, have to do, but also need to do. And this is one thing that I absolutely love about my new career is I pencil all these things in that I have to do or need to do or want to do and get to do. And then I'm like, okay, I have an hour here. I get to work my business here. I get to work my business there. Oh, Ruby has gymnastics, so I can work during that 45 minute gap here. She's getting ready to start volleyball, so I'm gonna get her signed up for that. And it's it's really nice. I've talked about this before in other episodes, but just slowing down so you can speed up. And it's all the little things that make a big difference. I have a lot of weight on my shoulders because there are a bunch of just shit that needs done and I don't like doing it and I don't wanna do it and I don't wanna run all these errands and go to this side of town and go to that side of town and go here, go there, do this, do that. But I know once I get all this craziness done, it's gonna make a big, big difference on how I feel and how my family feels. And so it's just been, it's been a really good weekend preparing for not only the week, but the end of the month. I'm scheduling stuff into September and it just feels really good to slow down, speed up. All right, peace. So lazy weekend prepared us for an amazing, amazing week. Didn't it, Ruby? Yeah. Taking Miss Ruby K to school and it's just gonna be a good week. What is the saying? If you plan, if you wait to plan, you plan to fail. <gasps> I don't really know what it is, but 
Um, having a weekend that we did nothing has made me really um, just grateful for the week to come. I know a lot of people I'm going to see. I know a lot of things that I'm going to do. It's like, <sighs> feels good. We are going to accomplish a lot. If you fail to plan, you plan to fail. Oh, that's what it is. That's what it is. Oh my gosh. And that's not always true, right? But since I did plan the uh, week ahead and have a lazy weekend, I'm going to kick this week's ass. It's on. Starting now.